Number one. Number two. One, two, three. We just paid $300 for this storage unit. Why? Because I have an obsession with old trunks and this thing is massive. There's got to be some type of treasure inside. Let's find out. Let's start going through the boxes right at the front. Usually I wouldn't touch a unit like this because well, I do have a medical condition that makes me allergic to devices like these. So I try not to touch them because they can make me sick. Let's see, what does that say? Kitchen? Is it really kitchen? That's an old dusty box though. No one's touched this in forever. Let's see. It does look like kitchen. Some glass. What is that? Just a big old red plate. Some old glassware. This just looks old, doesn't it? Yeah. Looks like an old vase. This looks like an old jar. Definitely looks old. Look at the writing on the bottom of it. One quart. That's kind of cool. And then we got more glasses, tablecloths. What's this one device right here? What is that? A uh, snackster? What's it make something? Open up. The oh, sandwich. look at that. This is the one I was telling you about all the time. This looks like it makes a mean grilled cheese. You know what I mean? Really good. This and that, they just don't go together. They really don't. That trunk is just so intriguing. It just looks like it has a whole story to tell inside. I know we like to be funny, but realistically, this is a Health Rider R65 treadmill. So of course that does have some value on its own. Let's start going into this box. It looks like mostly clothes. And after I was almost murdered by a black widow last time I went to the box, probably should just dump it out, huh? You know, <laughs> instead of just reaching my hands in it, let's just dump it on the floor and see if it's all closed like it says. Ugh. Come out, come out. Ugh. Well, I think from what I can see, they're telling the truth. What is that? Hmm. What it's like that a little cigarette stuff? case. Yeah, I was about to say, oh, it's kind of cool. Let's move this stuff around. A little bit. See if we see anything hidden inside. A raider's jacket. Where? This Where black you see one that? right here. That is, ugh. Uh, realistically, we're in California, so people like these gross team, right? Even though they're in Vegas, not technically. I still consider them the Oakland Raiders. But lots of other clothes around here. Most of it, just donation. Down here we got, what is that? Some Saram wrap? It's actually sticky though. I don't know what a roll this size would be used for realistically. That's crazy. If you know, let us know down in the comments. Let's toss it over there. We got another box right here. Let's get it out, come on. What do you think we got? It says linens. Linen. Blankets, are these all blankets? You know what these are great for realistically? Huh. Donations to animal shelters. They always need blankets, so that's probably where this box will go. Over here we got a little, what is it? Monster High bike with a kickstand. All right, put your guess in the comment. Which one of us can go further, Brandon, me or you? <laughs> I'm saying that because if you didn't know, I'm 29 years old. I've never ridden a bike in my life. So this is just a broken bone waiting to happen. But realistically, clean the dust up. It's in pretty good shape, so that's easy money all day. Now we got a full body mirror here so you can appreciate all the goodness. I'm just looking in here like, wow, look at that. Storage unit shorts that came out of a storage unit for some guy. Shoes that are six years old. I'm looking pretty good, right? Right. No, I think so I too. I think so too. What's back here? This is a giant picture of something. What is that? Flowers. Flowers. This looks like something somebody would put in like their dining room or something. Definitely a pretty big decor piece. Again, easy sale. So I was thinking this is just something you buy at like a decor store, but it feels more like a real canvas. And then I come to the back and there's this thing here, Agnes St. Ledger, born in North France, studied in France. And maybe this is an actual painting with some real value. If anyone knows that name again, please let us know in the comments. I've never heard of it. I think I got something great for you guys over there. Now you can wash it five down the chairs, you know? And they won't stay together. I got you guys, look. This is what we're gonna be watching the video in from now on. All for you, Merry Christmas. Wow. There you go. That nice. makes me so happy. <laughs> now you can watch this all. I mean, there you go. In like a beach decor mode. I don't know, actually this one has legs. That one doesn't have legs, but you know. That's good stuff, good stuff. You know what's crazy about this road trip we've been on? Two states ago, it was negative 17. Now it's 75 degrees in California. Like, what the heck? This is how people get sick. This is a dollhouse, if you can't tell. With an elevator. It has an elevator. Man, they get, they're living nice in this dollhouse right here. But these things are actually worth pretty good money, usually. Everything in this unit is just dusty, but again, Five minutes with a wet rag. This thing will look nice. Now let's start getting into these nicely stacked boxes in the back. And if you haven't left the video a thumbs up right now, what are you doing? What you are do you that. doing? Really? And hit that subscribe button if you're new because we got a lot of units coming up. I didn't like the sound of that. Uh, I don't like what the text says on that. Betting, Fabus. What is Fabus? Maybe it's the name. Oh man. You know what we don't have? 
A knife. We never have a what? knife. What? Because we don't have friends with us. I know because we're alone this time. We don't have a right. knife. Wait, let's just rip it then. You're and strong. There we go. There we go. Oh, I just ate a whole mouthful of dust. Look at your jacket. <laughs> yep. This thing's gotta go in the washing machine. Like right when we get back to our Airbnb later. Ugh. And well, they unfortunately are not lying. Blankets, pillows, more blankets. All donations. Maybe this box will be the good one. What does that say on the side? Again, same name room. Okay. Whatever their room. So that's that's definitely helping us figure out what's gonna be in here a lot. Ugh. Let's see. Look at the dust on here. I'm gonna need two showers after this unit. All right. Let's see. Yeah. Is this all pillows too? Oh no 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 no. We don't want it's just blankets and pillows. Like was that all you guys stored? Pillows and blankets? No, we got more boxes. We're gonna find something good. But again. This box is just gonna be donated. This one just says room. This one says bedding. Let's go to the not as exciting one first. Cause it does sound like it's just bedding, but never be too sure. Let's rip the box open. This tape is stronger than the rest. It doesn't matter. <laughs> For some reason. I know. Well, you can see in there. This one is actually accurate. Just blankets. Another donation box. This is the last of our big boxes. Can we please have something that's not blankets? I know you had to have more than blankets in your house. You had to, I would think. Let's see. Man, oh, oh, no, 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 this one's kind of different. Let's bring this one to the table. All right, what do we have in here? We got a bag. We got, this is like a, a something, like a little suit holder. It looks like a miniature suit holder, maybe for a kid's suit or something. Maybe. That. Red bag, whatever. What this is like that? A, I, I don't know. I don't <laughs> know. I'm trying to figure it out as I go, but it's not making much sense. Some paperwork. Papers, papers, lots of papers. What are these little things? Four dollar Christmas lights. That's not good. Let's go down here. This is a bag full of bags. Literally nothing else. Just a bunch of bags in there. Okay. It's better than blankets, you know. This is brand new. A fitted sheet. Nice. Okay. And then we got pillows and blankets and more blankets. But this one here. Looks like it could be hand stitched. I know a lot of you guys that watch your videos might know. Let us know if you think that's hand stitched or machine made. Normally I would say this is the clothes rack, but in these people's case, I think this is maybe like a blanket display piece to display the <laughs> numerous boxes of blankets they have. Let's see, oh, this box is heavy here. Here we go. Here comes the fun. Ugh. Oh, I sound like glass. I didn't like the sound of that. But glass can be expensive. So let's open it up and see what it is. Get off the paper. Get off. There it is. I see something. Ugh. Wow. Gosh. All right. All right. All right. Okay. There it is. <laughs> all that digging and we get a this tray. little glass tray. I don't see a make or brand on it, but that. And then we got perfume. Perfume. What brand is that? Chanel. Okay. We got some Chanel perfume. What about this one here? You see a brand on that? Uh, it just says Cristal. I don't see anything else on it. Look at this. This looks interesting. What is this thing? Is this a type of perfume too? It definitely looks fancy. You see that? Yeah, I guess that's a spray nozzle, right? Okay, yeah. Okay, now we're starting to get into some cool stuff. So let's get this glass out the way and go deeper in the box. Next, we have this thing. It says China Pearl on it. Well, look at that. Look at like the design on the outside of that. If that's actually Pearl, this could be pretty expensive right there. That's literally what it says on the back. Just find China, China Pearl. So guys, let us know in the comments what you know. Let's get some of this paper out the way. Is this a whole set? It, it looks, looks like oh, it. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah. This is gonna be a whole set of the same pattern. This China Pearl, fine China, made in China. Can you say China enough times on one plate? <laughs> so it looks like there's an entire, look right here. Saucers. I mean, you have tons of saucers, Cups. plates, cups. Yeah, you got definitely an entire set there. I bet you that is not cheap. We have one, two, three, is that four, five totes. I think four five. totes over there. Five For totes. First, five? Okay, yeah. Even better. Well, see on the floor down there, that that is all glassware. And by the sound, this just made by moving it. I'm gonna guess that's more glassware. And plus the fact that it says glass on top. Is this an ash? What is this? <laughs> that's a hammer. Okay, never mind. I was gonna use it to open this, but let's see. Let's just cut it open. There's nowhere to get a hold of anything here, is it? There it is. Just come on. This is. Oh, you spawned a knife. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Good spawn. Good spawn. Let's see what's in here. It is. 
Uh, a whole set of something. Oh look, just a bunch of little glasses. I mean, they're nice, clean. No, they are nice and clean. They look nice. They don't have a brand on the bottom of them, so I don't really know how to determine what they're worth, but <laughs> it is a nice, complete looking set. I'm still eyeballing that big trunk super hard because that thing is just so interesting. Let's mix it up now. We've gone through boxes, now let's go to totes. That sounds different. Doesn't sound like blankets or glass. This hey, toy. Stuffed animal. Little girl's toys. You got a bear, a koala, Elsa, right? <laughs> I no? don't know the difference. Okay. And yeah, look, he's a beanie baby. Everyone in the comment, one person's gonna tell me this is worth 50 cents, one person's gonna say it's worth 50,000. That's the thing with Beanie Babies, no one really knows. There's so many fake sales, but that looks like all stuffed animals. Tote number two here, let's see what's in this guy. Come on, something cool, something cool, something cool. Uh, not really, this looks more like school paperwork, school projects, things like that. This looks like a box, probably. Yeah, most definitely want to return and try to get back to the original owners of the unit. Let's see what's on the tote that's all the way on the floor here. Well, it's kind of see-through, so I guess you guys have an idea. I don't. This looks like more schoolwork. What's in here? This is, uh, not really sure. A jacket, maybe? Something like that. We have schoolwork, papers, all kinds of things like that. Random schoolwork. Again, this is a let's get back to the owner type of tote. Two more totes in the corner, and then we got some other stuff. What's in here? This is, well, more stuff than, was that Bambi? A it's deer. a deer. It's a deer. Some Beanie Babies. Is that, what, what the heck is that? A bird? A bird. A whale. A bunch of stuffed animals Sully. in general. What is this? What in the world is this thing? A hat and gloves. Okay, a hat and gloves. Where did you see Sully? I didn't see Sully. Over here. Where? Near you. I didn't see, oh, there he is. Sully from Monster Sully. Day 2. So you know what? That might be valuable for sure. Last of these kind of totes right here. This one's that not see through. says electronics on the side. Ooh, do we have some cool ones? Oh, that looks so much better than anything else I've opened. Really? Let's see. That's a laptop case, dang it. This is a Fire HD 7. The weight feels right, actually. Let's see. Mm, dang it. <laughs> Empty box. The weight of boxes? That's my specialty. It is. Look what I see. Uh, let's, what's this? Oh, cool, cool picks. picks. Uh, that does feel right. Please don't be books. Please don't be books. No, no. Well, no camera, just the freaking box. But I see what looks like a camera loose right here. Look, is that the cool picks? Come out there. No, that's a Sony Cybershop though, but it's a nice digital camera. We're on the right track now. Now we're moving in the right direction. What about this? Beat Solos? Are they in there? Let's see. Come on. Come on. Be good to me. Eh. Why is this box so hard to open? No. Why is there so many boxes? But no electronics. Besides the camera. I mean, we'll take that. Amazon. Is it in there? No. It doesn't feel like it. Let's see. This one? Ah! can't tell. Why did they keep all these? What, this the tablet? Bang. No. Dang it. What about this? Nothing. This, ooh look, this is a Canon Rebel. This is a nice camera if it's in there. Please, please, please. I feel weight. Don't be all bucks. Don't be all bucks. Well, you know what? It's looking like it's gonna be all bucks in the charging cable. Dang it. Well, this right here, this is probably the phone we just box we just saw, so there's at least the phone. We got that. The Apple box right here. Mm, mm, feels right. Weight wise. Oh, they got the receipt and everything in there. Just not well, <laughs> just not the actual camera. iPhone 4S box. Come on. Dang it, no. What about ooh, that's something. What is this? Come out, come out, come out. Let's see. What is this? What in the heck is that? It's got a camera Some on it. Some kind of camera. Minnow HD. Weird. We'll set okay. that over here. Um, there's that. Is that what that is? Yeah, it looks yeah, like it. There it is. And then we got this, this. What about this? That is a Dell something. But it's just papers, unfortunately. And that looks like the end of the tote. Now let's get into this drawer. Ooh, these are heavy. There's a little set of plastic drawers here. They got some weight to them. Let's see what's in there. What, is that? what the heck? Come back, come back, come back. 
Some type of jewelry for sure. We'll look at that in a bit, see if it's marked silver or anything. What's the card? Oh, that's an actual card. Yeah. At least it gives us their name. What in the heck is that? That's like a little keychain. Okay, weird stuff. These staples, uh, a few pictures, and anything else interesting in there? Not so much in the first door, maybe the second door. Well, <laughs> third door? There's something. What's all this? Come out, come out, come out. In the envelopes, new laptop. These are the receipts. Very nicely organized tax receipts. What about the money to pay your taxes? You don't want to put that in there too, you know, just to be good. You know, that'd be a good idea. Then store it. No, it's just paperwork. This looks like exclusively paperwork. Anything in the bank envelope? No, nothing. What about the bottom drawer? Oh, that. Well, it looks random, all right, but I can't get in there. Is this just little index cards? Yeah, little index cards. Get out. You gotta push push the top down. Let's pull some cards out. All right. Maybe some cards got some money in them, right? right. Let's check it out. Bang. Well, that's a lot of writing, but no money. Again, we'll make sure they get this stuff back. We'll open one more up and check. Come out, please. No, no money. Let's work on getting this drawer open. Let's see what's in there. Now we got it all the way open. We can see a little checkbook, some papers, some more envelopes. I'm gonna open up at least, what's that? Let's check this first. Then we gotta look in a couple envelopes. Another checkbook. No money inside of it, unfortunately. But let's see anything inside of these. No, just letters. This one feels a lot thicker. It's actually sealed. This was the giant $10,000 payment they received and the mail never opened. Right? Right. No, it's just a freaking letter and random papers. Let's see what's in the trunk. I think they left us this on purpose just in case this thing doesn't want to open. But let's hope we don't have to use it. Let's see. Number one. Number two. And they're going to make us open it, aren't they? Yep. All right. Well, <laughs> I thought it would be easy, but no. Nope. See, we should just be able to pry this in here, right there, and just pop it. No. Oh. No, huh? Just hit, hammer it, and then try to do it. I think I'm thinking it's tighter. Well, let's see. Let's get down here and personal. All right. It's, it doesn't make no sense. Like, it's just nothing keeping it shut. You know what I mean? Yeah. What in the heck is this? All right, let's see if we can get this in here. One, two, three. One, two, three. Hey. Oh. There it goes. Good job. Just destroy the trunk, but now we get to know what's on the inside. You ready? Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. Let's see. And now I'm crying because there's nothing in there. Now that we're done with that storage unit, we're going to take that one that we bought for $420 with all the electronic parts. We're actually going to take that to the stock flea market in California for old time's sake and see what money we can make. Let's do it. This pile of beauty here is everything in the unit. It's covered in the tarp. Turn away until it gets a little more daylight to start taking stuff out. But what did I say at the unit? Those tools are gonna go instantly. Bang. See, this is called innovation. Put two tables, you put the old door in the middle, and you make one super long table. All my idea. No, I'm lying. I installed this idea from the storage auction pirate, but you know what? This will make the stuff a lot easier to get to. Well, there was no charger in the unit. It's got something hanging on the rear. Oh, that's the charging port. This was not damaged like this. I would say easily 100. Being as it's damaged like that, I would probably be happy with a 50. So there's this one. No, that would have been a really nice scooter if it was beat up. And then there's a, I think these are like lime That would have been like a thousand dollar scooter. What, Air compressor. Right That's a good one. That's like a hundred. I told him 25 so on this. Machine. He's trying to go 20 on it. 23 and 7 for the other ones for the story. Ooh, look at that snap on. Weird. Yeah. Ooh. Two pieces of snap on. Jeez. He only goes for the good stuff. That's got to be 45. Come on. What's that for? Skill saw. Uh, you owe him 33. 30. So you owe him 67. Let me see if I change for 100. <laughs> you don't have any small change here. You have anything smaller? Not really, no. No. Can you break 100? I'll give you 96. See? I'm just kidding. Deal, there you go. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. So you get one, two, three, four, five, and we're done. Give us six. Okay. And then we go from there. All right. Ten. Here's a twenty uh, for that. For the tool. Oh, for the tool. Thank you. Here's sixty. Give him another twenty. Nah. <laughs> nice try. 
67. You looking at? How much the cable? Uh, 10 bucks. 10 bucks? Yeah. Is that what you got? Yeah. Uh, how about 20? <laughs> no? How about 10? Okay, okay, give me 10. Alex said don't let that thing go for us. Thank you. I said 25, right? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. How about 20? Don't leave here with nothing. <laughs> Come back at me. How about 10? 10 bucks. Yep, 50% off right now. Alright. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What do you think? Not for 20? Uh, no. 15? 10. 10. Not good? Okay. Thank yeah, good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much. I'll give you the deal. Yeah. 50% off instantly. Uh, uh, Let's see so. what this is. One, two, three, four, five. Uh -huh. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. How about five bucks? Yeah, five bucks. Okay. <laughs> It's a nice scooter. Thank you. To rental. Okay. Yeah. I've had so many stolen from me. I bet. I yeah. bet. I'm gonna get it on my way out. Okay. Okay. I'll set it in the back. Okay. Let's see. Twenty. Twenty. Fifteen. Two. Three. Four. Five. There you go. Thank you. Uh huh. Four. Uh oh. Hey. I don't owe you. Got a dollar. What? You got a dollar? I gave you one. Oh wait, I have it in my other pocket. Haha. Uh -huh. There you go. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> Don't put it down. Five bucks. Five. Four. Yeah. Deal. One. Thank you. Yeah, but this is all I have right here. We have one, two, three, four shelves. Five. Three. Okay. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. You don't have the charger for this? Not that I know of. I got storage unit, so. How much? Uh. Five. What? The jersey? Oh, for that? Um. Let me see this one. Hey. Uh, seven. Do 10 bucks. Yeah, 10? 10 for the outfit. That's a good outfit. <laughs> Aha. There you go. All right. Thank you. I'm very Have a good day. How about 20 for all? How about 10? 50 percent off right now. No? <laughs> <laughs> it didn't work that time. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Let's round up to the nearest hundred. Oh, you said okay? Huh? You said okay? Yeah. Okay, deal. Oh, I was just <laughs> What happened to 10? <laughs> I thought you said it on three, though. <laughs> I'll tell you what I'll, I'll fine, fine, that fine. change. All right, all right. Last thing? I'm gonna have 10 bucks. Uh-uh, me. You. Don't listen Show to him. You. I'll give you something Thank you. you. Go buy something from his booth. What? <laughs> what do you got? You just got something for a dollar? You got this little glass case? You got two more things? Hold on. Two things. Cheap stuff! All I got is 14. Here, just take them. Free. No, I'll, tell you, I'll come back. Okay. No, no, if you I'll get changing, come back. No, no, no. I, I, got I don't have it. Yeah, all I got is 14. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Two bucks. <laughs> Dollars. I'll keep you happy while you're here. So you won't leave empty handed. What, what was that? Two more things? Yeah. One, two, three. How much is this guy? Thank you. Thank you. And your cap? I don't know. What would you pay for it? Five, Five bucks? Yeah, it's fine. That was gonna be. I'm in. <laughs> I don't remember. I'll do a dollar on that too. Five though. Thank you. Dollar two? 
Yeah. No, that's five. Oh, that was good shit. That Thank was like you. thirty bucks. So. Oh yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks. Thank you. Finding all the good stuff. A uh, dollar piece, like five bucks. Two dollar. <laughs> I'll give it to you for a dollar. Dollar. <laughs> How many things did you get? How many things? I got four. Four. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you for you. Three. Thank you. Five bucks for all those. Uh, for this one. Like 40, 20, 50% 50 off right now for you. <laughs> no? It's beautiful though. I love the colors on it. The five dollar for those. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. No. The My mine don't quite 15? make it there. Oh. Ten bucks. I'll take ten. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's a good goal. Hear that, Amber? Huh? My goal in life is to pass you guys on Facebook. <laughs> Fair enough. Healthy he ha competition. He has, a, he has a channel there. Uh, Here you go. Boat restoration. They got like Thank seventy thousand. Thank you. You know um, what I bet it is? Thank you. I bet it's a graded tank. No, but once you start getting the camera. Okay. Here you go. One, two, three, four, nine. Thank you. Here's one. Thank you. You want the little one? Yeah. <laughs> Might as well. Thank you. Yep, thank you. Four, five. Yep, five bucks. Find something else for a dollar. Oh wait, I'm one? kidding. Yeah, you can do that. Thank That's you. for a dollar. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For two of them or this too? No, just that. Uh, I don't know, five bucks too? Yeah. For everything, come on. For everything? 20? Five, five, ten. Ten. Ten, me lo dan diez, por con todo y este, mira, con todo y este, diez. Diez, todos. Ten dólares por él. Sí. Ah, eighty. Yeah. Yeah. Allá ahorita lo ves, si no, pues allá los tiran. Oh, so much to eat up. One, two, three, four, five. We found a subscriber. Shout out to Adrian and Michael. Came out to see us at the flea market. So we were getting a little hungry. Jeebus goes on a trip to get chicken on a stick. And I asked him, I was like, what is it? He was like, I don't know. I asked for chicken on a stick and this is what they gave us. So yeah. I guess we're about to I mean, find I out. hope it's chicken on a stick. Let's see. 
I don't like the color of that. Oh. What is it? Dip your finger in it. Does it smell spicy? Actually, no, not at all. Huh. I don't know what it is. No, it doesn't. And I can't stand spice. I don't well, know what that is. Taste test. Alright, let's see. <laughs> I ain't getting it on my fingers. I don't need blood. Might be sweet. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's good, huh? Hey, yeah. Hey. Karaoke. Woo! Maybe in two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. Or a month should be good. Yeah. So we took to like. Do you have change? Huh? Do you have any change? We was five days of course driving not. from the east to here. No, Just take it. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. We do it in like ten days usually. Come back and pick them up, okay? Okay, I'll put it back here. You send the electric scooter in the back? That works? Uh no, it's for like a project. Oh okay. Yeah. Thank you. Five. What is it for? I don't know. <laughs> I'm being honest with you, I have no clue. If five doesn't work, just give me your number. <laughs> A dollar. A dollar? Yeah. Okay. I don't want you to walk right empty handed. Okay. Thank you. One dollar. Thank you. Wait, this. Ah, uh, 10 bucks. Thank you. <laughs> How about five bucks for everything? Tell me these aren't freaking nice. I stole them from, from Storage Alex. Doctor. Yep. I will be rocking them. <laughs> they seemed like you shoes. Do you have a bag? I don't. There's random bags. <laughs> Try to empty. Thank you. Thank you. What is it? Three? There you go. Thank you. Uh huh. Dollar, dollar, dollar! Air compressor, dollar! Dollar. Dollar. Everything, one dollar. Everything, one dollar right here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Dollar less? Yeah. What do you want, RC stuff? Yeah. A whole box? Yeah. How about that too. What? This? Yep. Okay. Or just the body, yeah. How about 10 bucks? 10 bucks, okay. I gotta say hi to your husband though. Yeah. <laughs> I'll drag him over here. Yeah, in a second. Okay, hurry up. No, no, no. <laughs> I got you. Hold on. He wants to say hi. Huh? This guy wants to say hi. Can I take a photo with you guys? Of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to be in the video. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, you yeah. got it. Small to big? Small to big? Yeah. Okay. You're in the middle. <laughs> You're in the middle. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Yeah. Anything you find within that ten dollars, you can have it because you're a subscriber. You get a deal. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you get a better deal than everybody else. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. You too. Did you see the helicopter down there? No, I did. That piece right there. Really like the first thing I saw. Okay. Yeah. I mean, any anything you find that you want to put in there, yeah. just put in there. If you want. Yeah. You're welcome. What is this? Huh? What are we doing? I'm confronting this stalker. Storage stalker? You're the one that came to my property tripping. I think we're both actually Listen, sitting on Pirate's property. What is he tripping about? I don't know. I mean, we are confronting a stalker I right now. I think you're sitting on someone else's couch. I yeah, think somebody bought actually it. bought this. We're sitting on a stranger's couch. I've been selling cuddles off the couch. <laughs> How much? Dollar, but now we're gonna go free pretty soon. Oh. <laughs> Dollar a cuddle, two dollars a spoon. <laughs> what can I get for 20? Whoa! Whoa. Yeah. Dollars for this yeah, we can do that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I gotta get my money. Okay. Thank you. Free, all right here, free, free, free! Oh, 
Every time we go to this flea market and we get to the end, there's just no point in keeping this stuff. If you can't sell it for a dollar, you might as well sell it for free. And when we call free, the crowd comes in, as you can see on screen right now. Tons of people came through and pretty much took every last thing that we had. We ended up making about $432 overall. It was definitely fun and nostalgic to come back to the Stockton flea market.